The Pocophone F2 may have just been finally certified and I'll be sharing all the details right after this. If you're new here and want to stay up to date with the latest tech, please hit subscribe followed by the bell. So the Pocophone was an incredibly successful device thanks to its flagship hardware but with many compromises that made it the cheapest device with the latest system on chip. While many have been disappointed with no mention of the Pocophone F2, that's now changed and we should see the Poco F2 before the end of the year. A new Xiaomi device has received approval from the 3C Authority of China. While identity is not yet known, it's thought that this could be the much-awaited Pocophone F2. The listing also revealed that the Pocophone F2 will only be 4G. Last week, popular smartphone maker Spigen listed a rugged armor case for the Pocophone F2 on the official website. The renders used, however, were that of the Redmi K20 Pro, meaning we could see a device the same in specs, but rebranded as the Pocophone F2. We've had a couple of hints from Xiaomi to let us know that the device may be coming as well. First of all, we had a tweet from the general manager of Poco India that stated a few of the achievements from Xiaomi this year, followed by the question, is the Poco F2 coming? While this doesn't confirm too much on its own, it's a clear hint that they will be releasing something. Next up, we've got an image at a planning meeting for Xiaomi and directly behind both execs, we can see a whiteboard of product launches. If we zoom into the board, we can see F2 written under the last quarter, which looks to be a November launch. Now, of course, these aren't solid leaks, but at least it will bring plenty of hope for those who have been holding out for the latest Pocophone F2. The previous Pocophone was launched in August at an incredibly cheap price of $286, so hopefully we get something similar this time round. When it comes to the specs and design, most people are speculating that we're going to see something the same as the K20 Pro, but rebranded as the Pocophone F2. When it comes to the display, we get a full screen display thanks to a pop-out selfie camera. The display is going to measure in at 6.39 inches and will be a super AMOLED display with a resolution of 2340 by 1080 there's going to be an in-display fingerprint scanner and it will be protected by Gorilla Glass 5. The pop-out selfie camera will contain a 20 megapixel sensor with an aperture of f2.2. When it comes to the rear, we'll be getting a triple camera setup consisting of a 48 megapixel wide-angle lens with an aperture of f2.8 and this will of course be the primary sensor. It will be accompanied by an 8 megapixel telephoto with an aperture of f2.4 and 2 times optical zoom and finally we get a 13 megapixel ultra wide with an aperture of f2.4 we get dual led flash hdr and panorama shots with 4k video at 60 frames a second it's expected to be powered by the latest snapdragon 855 plus although no confirmations from xiaomi yet so it could be the standard 855 we're expecting 6 and 8 gigabyte ram variants with a choice of 64 128 or 256 storage it's reportedly going to contain a 4000 milliamp hour battery with 27 watt fast charging and it will of course be running MIUI in the form of Android 10 and it will be retaining the 3.5mm headphone jack. When it comes to pricing, the Poco F2 is expected to launch in India at a price of $320 or £300, so a little bit higher than its predecessor but it's still considerably cheaper than all of the 855 devices on the market. Overall, it's looking to be another great device and of course, while it doesn't have high spec everything, it still packs the latest generation system on chip, making it a great budget device for gamers and people who just want a capable phone. Of course, these are leaks and rumors and we haven't had anything solid from Xiaomi yet, but as soon as any information comes to light, I'll be sharing with you guys straight away. As always though, I'd like to know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think of the Pocophone F2? Who out there is waiting to get one? And do you think the phone is actually going to be launched this year? But thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, smash a thumbs up. If you didn't hit the thumbs down twice and I'll see you guys in the next one.